Hello everybody, Dead Spikes here. Today I'm making a video talking about the strongest weapon currently in the game of Grounded. This game is still pretty early release. There are a few weapons, but we're going to be going over the strongest one. This weapon is built in a workbench, and it is called the Mint Mallet. It is currently the only thing that is tier 3 in the game as of now. Here are the things you need to create it. Spider Silk, Flower Petal, and a Mint Chunk. Um, flower Petal you get from the flowers around the map you can just pick them up off the ground spider silk you're gonna have to kill spiders and mint chunk is the rare thing here that you probably have not heard of yet and you might not know where to get it so i'll be going over where to get it now you can look at the damage stat on this thing it is crazy the second strongest weapon is the ant club and it is nearly double of the ant club's damage it is ridiculous i think it five shots wolf spiders no, six shots wolf spiders. It's six shots wolf spiders, and I think it like five shots um, the other spiders or weavers. And it's crazy. It takes three hits to stun. I think the ant club's probably the same. But it, this is the best weapon. It will kill wolf spiders very easy. Um, enough of that. Let's get into it. Let's craft it real quick. Um, also, the tool that you will need to be able to get mint is the level two hammer, which is also in here. It's called the insect hammer. Here are the three things that you will need. Stink bugs from killing stink bug bugs, which are on the west side of the map. Um, berry leather, which is on the east side of the map. You'll get from the berries up in the berry bush. You got to shoot down or hit down. Oiling gland is something you get from the bombardiers, which are the insects on the southwest of the map. Um, ours is one spot. It spawns at a few places, but there you go. There's the insect hammer. You got to get the blueprint on how to make it. All right, we're going to go over where to get um, the mint now to be able to make this mint mallet. Also, one thing I want to note is when you are using the mint mallet, I highly recommend spider armor because it's going to give you faster stamina regen and you also move quicker, which is quite great. Another tip for you is um, put your weapon away when you are running because it will make you slightly faster, which is great. But as you see, we just took a left there at that baseball, and we're going straight. We made it up to this, and we're just going to go straight across. You can already pretty much see it right there. This is what we're looking for. This is the mint container right here. Da -da 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 -da. If you want to see it on the map, there I am on the map. Up there in the top left area. Okay. Um, I'm not sure if these things respawn yet, but you actually have to use your hammer. I kind of think this was a secret spot. I don't think we were supposed to find this very easily. But yeah, if you just hit this a few times, boom, it opens right up. And what is this? This is a mint. Now you can get your uh, mints from this. Just using your level 2 hammer. I don't, it looks like it's not working for me. Might be because I'm on journey mode. Oh, there we go. Mint Mallet's also a hammer, which is kind of great. You can use the insect hammer to get it. There's also a nice little trick that you can do. Now that we're out of that, that was kind of annoying. All right, you can also just come underneath this rather than opening it up if you want. I mean, opening it up makes it a little bit easier, but you can also reach through and grab this one right here, which is pretty cool. You did not want to open it and try to get through that annoying door. Um, I haven't verified if these respawn or not yet. I'm kind of feeling like they don't. And this is the only mint container we found. There might only be a certain amount of mints you can have in a world. That might be something you want to think about when you're having a multiplayer world. Um, it looks like you get about six mint per uh, mint that's in here. I don't know how many are in here. There's four. So you killed two and there's still two more in there. Looks like you get about the 24. Mints? How much was that going to make? 24 mints will make four of these. You'll be able to make four mint mallets um, out of everything that spawns here. If they do respawn, then you can make more, but I, I haven't seen any more respawn yet. Um, also, if, in case you were curious to repair this, I don't know if I'll be able to see it. There you go. You can see it's five quartzite right there. It costs five quartzite to be able to repair the mint mallet. You don't need mint for it, which is nice. Um, and that'll do it right there. Go try this thing out. It's pretty crazy. I think you'll be quite impressed. You gotta learn that, uh, parrying with that wolf spider if you want to fight it. But this thing is the best to take them on for sure. That'll do it for this video. If you guys enjoyed it or it helped you out at all, please make sure to hit that thumbs up button. It does help me out a lot. If you have not yet, please consider subscribing to the channel. I will be making content for this game for a little while here. Hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I'll see you in the next video. Spikes out.